And a big shakeup with the state's health department. What we know so far. And that is where we start tonight. Thank you for joining us. I'm Brooke Lennington. Tonight, the state's top doctor, Lee Norman, is stepping down. The governor making that announcement just a couple of hours ago. And our Capitol Bureau reporter, Rebecca Chung, joining us live at the State House now. So, Rebecca, you reached out to the governor's team and the state's health department about this today. What did they have to say about this sudden decision for him to leave the department? Well, Brooke, we reached out to find out why Dr. Norman is deciding to step down and what or who could be behind that decision. But right now, the governor's team and the state's health department say they will not be commenting publicly on this tonight. Dr. Norman has served as health secretary since 2019, spearheading the state's response to coronavirus. The last time we were able to speak with him in person was in July, when the highly contagious Delta variant just started spreading earlier this year, and Norman warning people of the variant and urging them to get vaccinated. Hospitalizations going up, deaths are going up, due primarily to this spread of the Delta virus. It is the unvaccinated people who are in the hospitals having the worst clinical outcomes and deaths. The best way to combat the Delta strain, as well as all the other ones, is vaccination. Epidemic proportion. Now, there are some reports pointing to months of internal conversations leading up to the state health secretary leaving. Now, some major shifts in leadership are underway. Another top state health official, Deputy Secretary Ashley Goss, will be taking over Norman's role until a permanent replacement is found. Live at the Capitol, covering local news that matters, Rebecca Chung, KSNT News. All right, thank you, Rebecca.